Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the Feed the Beast Monster series with me Bashful Brit as usual. As you can hear there is a pretty loud sound going on um, and I have no idea what it is. Clip Addict has left this. Give me one mil diamonds for, the, for me to stop this. Clip Addict. So this is why I'm speaking quite loudly. Actually let's just do this for a minute. Turn that down to about four. Right, that's a bit more manageable. Okay, so <clears throat> Clip Addict seems to have installed a howler alarm inside of our base. And I have not the faintest clue where it is. He's probably put the range all the way up on it as well. <clears throat> so fuck knows where he's put it. And... Right, it's inside somewhere. We know that much. It's not over here. <clears throat> Space Invader has not morphed anymore. So the, the Howler Alarm is inside somewhere. And apparently we have to pay Clip Addict 1 million diamonds for this to stop. And we only have 5,000. Sorry, hiccups. Um... So we only have 5,000 diamonds, so I'm not sure how we're going to pay. Um, he did leave me a message and he was just like, um, <clears throat> I didn't do anything, it wasn't me. He messaged me on Facebook saying it wasn't me. I didn't know what he'd done, but I've come in and he's power alarm somewhere. I have no idea where it is either. Oh, he's such a dick. I will find this. I'm not paying a million diamonds. What's he done? Oh my days. What an idiot. So, the volume is going to be very low on this episode, I'm afraid. Um, I don't... Unless he's put it all the way downstairs. Where has he put it? Right, I haven't got a clue. He also put, P.S. I help with the butterflies. I didn't want you to help with the butterflies. Um, <laughs> I come on and I was messing around. I was trying to figure out what to do for these walls here. And I had this Tesseract here, an auto spawner here, and I had some butterflies in there. He spawned a couple in, but I wanted to do the whole thing with you guys. Uh, which we might as well just do now. Hang on, I'm sure that wasn't there wasn't a hole here before. There's his power thing that I was borrowing. Oh yeah, we ran out of power, we're still running off clip addicts. Um Where has he put it? This is like the worst prank you could ever do on someone. It's horrible. Oh, bastard. Right, we will get him. We will get him for this. We'll get him back. We're going to go prank. I'm going to figure out something to prank him eventually. And we're going to go get him back. Um, we're using this ethereal glass, which we can pass through. But the butterflies don't seem to be able to. Uh, but yes, I wanted to do this with you guys. <coughs> so I'm going to grab this. We've got our auto spawner here. It's got the mob essence in it. It's got some power when we turn this on. So what we're going to do is going to pop that in. Spawn exact copy. And no, we do not want you spawning exact copies. And disable the redstone thing on it. <coughs> there you go. And this is now going to spawn us in some butterflies. And this whole area is going to be covered in butterflies. It's going to look beautiful. Oh, he's such a pain in the ass. I can't believe he put a howler alarm in here. But yes, I wanted to spawn in all the butterflies with you guys. Um, he put one in. There was a bit of power in here. So I think he's chucked it in and used up the power that we did have in there. That butterfly is going to drown. Why are you so stupid? But yes. So there we go. We have butterflies going through. So we're going to take that out. We're going to disable this again. I'm going to add some more at a later date. Because I think these things are going to get in the way of us trying to place things down uh, so when we're building things they're going to get in the way which is going to be a pain in the ass I did this staircase, I can't remember if I showed you this and I did the spring and I did all of this and I start printing it up I'm going to put some trees in I wanted to decide what I wanted for the walls I couldn't pick anything um, but I think we're going to have to 
He's not put it in behind one of these, is he? Where's my wand? Wand is over here. Should <laughs> really shouldn't leave that lying around. Uh, we also started setting up a bit of Thorncraft stuff. Shit me, that went quick. So we've still got 64 in there. Um, let's grab me some more blaze rods. Okay, I don't have that many. I got 20k blaze essence though, which... Okay, so it's not that howler alarm. I took out the howler alarm that I had installed. And I thought he might have just activated that. Um, it appears not. All right, how do we lay this out? Like that, okay. This would be so much quicker if we did this in the system, which is what we're gonna go do. So let's have a look. Let's just quickly see something. Take out cat, we don't like cat. No one, like, no one wants to listen to freaking cat. Hang on, have we already got cat? We've got cat, so why have we got another cat? Go away. Um, let's put on this. This is a really nice song to listen to. It's from the portal mod. Pop you in. There you go, that's a little bit better, but not a great deal. I'm going to have to kick his ass when I find him. Cancel on this area for butterflies, that's what we're doing. Uh, so we are working on that sort of list thing there. Um, I'm really sorry about this howl alarm, I can't turn it off. I tried to put a bit of music behind it, not working, not helping at all. So we want to make a couple of these. Pop these in. And then we're going to pop that in. I'm going to pop these in here, like a so. And then these are all going to burn up. Oh, we need some more coal in there as well, actually. Let's see if we can manage something with that. Fill you up with a bit more coal, shall we? Lovely, lovely. So yes, what we have going on here, I'm actually, I'm just gonna turn the sound off. There you go. There you go, sound is gone. So we're gonna have no sounds in this game, unfortunately, apart from my wonderful voice, which you guys seem to love. I'm joking. Uh, but yes, 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 yes. We are making up some thormium ingots. We're going to make a ton of thormium ingots. We've still got thormium here. We've got iron there, iron there, all being converted. Um, I've set up these filter the century achievements. These things are brilliant. I've never used them before, uh, but they are absolutely wonderful. Uh, you can automate all of this process pretty much. Like I've got blaze rods just scooting over here. I've got coal here burning them up. I've got the Ignis being put into this void jar, so any excess is being voided. All of the Ignis goes off in this direction. All of the other crap goes off in this direction. So that's fantastic. All the other Precantatia, sorry, goes over to here, because that's all we need to make this, is for Precantatia. And then the Hungry Chest, and then it spits out the front, and the Hungry Chest picks it up like the good little thing it is. So that's fantastic, that there's working. What I wanna do is put purple in these walls because there's not enough purple down here. So we're gonna add a little bit of purple. Probably add a couple of this glowstone in behind, not as much as we've got at the moment because I'm not too keen on the glowstone. So that is what's happening there. And then we're gonna put some trees down here, maybe put like a fallen log, put some mushrooms and stuff, make, give it a bit of um, floral stuff. Just make it look a bit pretty. And these butterflies are going to get in the way, so... So I can't kill them. Right. I know this might upset some people, but just remember we have a spawn here, and I can spawn as many butterflies as I want to spawn. So we're going to get rid of all the butterflies. Just for the time being, there will be more, I promise you. But yes, for now, we're just going to get rid of them. Just so that they don't interfere with us building down here. That is the reason I didn't do it before. Uh, clip out, it didn't realize that though. So that's fine. Um, so let's grab ourselves some logs. 
And we're going to start building ourselves some trees. And we've got mushrooms. And we've got loads of different flowers and stuff like that. So it should be pretty cool once we get going on it. Uh, might do something funky like build a tree in here. Just do something like this. Nope, didn't want to do that. Where's the... I haven't got an axe on me. What an idiot. Right, let's have a look. I should have one in here. Should have one. Should have one. Axe, where are you? There you are. So, yeah. I'm sorry there's no sound this game. I'm going to have to find a way to get a million diamonds. I don't know why he wants diamonds. You can process them like anything. Uh, but <laughs> regardless, it looks like we might have to pay that. Or just destroy the base, just nuke, just nuke the entire place and start over. Um, but I don't think you guys would be too happy about that if we did that. Uh, so we're just gonna, we're gonna leave it for now. We're just gonna chill out with the sounds off. Let's see what uh, leaves we've got. See if we've got any willow, because willows are nice to have. We've got some silverwood tree leaves, which would be pretty cool, but we've only got 10 of them, so we can't go too mad. Um, Let's just grab some oak leaves. They're going to go... The only reason I don't like them is because they go too bluish. I mean, this is really nice. Yep, screw it. I'm going to go get willow trees. Uh, willow, willow. So we're going to make ourselves up some willow trees because they're the only ones that don't seem to change. Uh, that are like got a really nice green color to them. Uh, they're the only ones that don't seem to change in the magical forest biome. So we're going to grab ourselves a couple of these. Because these look quite nice. They work well on the house. Uh, they keep their greenish texture. Which you don't see a lot of in this biome. Uh, you always see the bluey stuff. I need to release Joey. I keep meaning to do that. But I keep forgetting. Also. <laughs> uh, so we're going to place down a couple of these. So many flowers. Are my bees still going? No, they've stopped. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I did have that automated, but it seems to have broken because we seem to have lost. Um, if you have a look, we've lost our queens. I'm not sure how that's happened. Oh, well, this one's working. Kind of. It's now just got too many combs in it. Um, carpenter. Okay, I remember. None of this has power. All of these need power to function, and I have no power for any of them because my power grid is offline at the moment. So I need to fix that. Oh, hello. Tree's done already. Um, so what do we need? We need shears because we want leaves. So we're going to do them. So I need to sort out the power option at some point as well. I'll probably do that off of the camera next. Uh, that's the first thing that I really need to be working on. I'm not sure how I'm going to go about doing it. But there will be a way of that we come up with something. Something will work in that aspect. But we're just going to grab ourselves some leaves. Stick them on a tree downstairs. Make trees. Make things look beautiful. I actually quite like them logs as well. I think I might get rid of the oak. And I'll use these willow logs. Because these willow logs look very nice indeed. I hate it when the trees connect and the leaves don't automatically break. I like the pink ones as well. We should keep some of them. Might just go on like a random leaf collection thing. Do with it do. So yeah, this should work out quite nicely. Uh, let's just grab a couple more of these. How many have we got so far? Almost got stacks. So we'll go just over a stack, maybe two stack. Two stack would do. Two stack would be plenty, actually. I don't know where else I might use these leaves, though. So, But I need the wood, so... Screw it. That's enough. Um, stacking a bit. Good enough. Good enough, indeed. So we're going to stick oak leaves in there. Just to get them out of the way for the minute. And then we're going to chop this down. We're going to take the wood. Chop this down. Take the wood. Ugh. 
could have walked around that, but chopping it down was a hell of a lot easier. And then get all of these, pick up all the saplings so we can grow some more of these in the future. Because I really do like these trees. I love the logs, I love the wood, I love the branches. It's all pretty cool. Now these trees over here work quite well. I did terraform them a little bit with the leaves and add some overhang on them myself. But in general, it came out pretty well. I hope this howler alarm f turns off. Uh, so, oh, I've just come up with something fantastic. Right, hang on. I'm going to see if this works. If this works, it's going to be fantastic. Um, it's... Uh, So no, no. Open blocks, sonic glasses. So we want one of the, we want some of these if we can, uh, please. Oh, I got loads of willow leaves. Uh, chuck lavender in there. Don't need that. Don't need night ore. Don't need oak wood logs. Keep some oak wood logs on us. So we need to make an iron helmet. If this works. This is going to be the best way. Uh, to combat the situation as such. So we go like that, grab ourselves our sonic glasses of awesome beautifulness. Stick these on like so. And now... Okay. No, we should... If we can hear it, we should be able to see it. We can see all the f light things through this. Basically, what these do... Um, is these will detect sound. Wait, is it like going by the fact that I have no sound on? Nope, okay. So I'll turn the sound back off. I was really hoping that would work. That would be so cool if we could find it that way. Look at them. I look like such an idiot. <laughs> but no. Um, so I'm not sure how we're ever going to find that. <laughs> Uh, that's quite worrying. How much of this we got? Quite a bit, quite a bit, quite a bit. Looking good. So we're going to grab some of these. We're going to grab some of these. And we're going to chop all this down. Hmm. Let's, have, let's try this, actually. Let's try... Uh, have I got equal trade on already? Yes, I do. So if we take that one out... Pop you in there. Go like that. I think, hang on, hang on. I think we're going to need a special tool. We're going to need this. Just in case. Okay, so it only changes the ones that are sideways. Cool. Okay, so that doesn't work on these logs, apparently. Uh, generally, that works. Um, so we're going to get rid of these quickly. And then what we'll do is we'll just go plot, plot, and then what we'll do is we'll... No, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to copy it. Okay, so apparently it won't copy turned logs, which sucks quite a bit. Um, that's fine, that's fine. We're only doing a small project. It's not like it's a huge tree and we're screwed. Oh, we could put anything in there, really. <laughs> no one's going to know. Save ourselves on a bit of materials. So we're going to go out like that. And then we're going to pop this one out by one. And then we're going to go get some leaves. And we're going to pretty this up. Okay, that's not looking too bad to start off with. That's why I wanted extra, because I knew I was going to waste some like that. Now we've got one more on that one. Not sure about that there, so I'll take a bit off the top there. Probably take... That looks alright like that, and then we'll put a couple more trees. I'm not going to mirror it exactly. I don't want, like, as, 
As much as I love symmetry in this game, I'm not going to go too much onto it. Uh, I'll do something like this as well. That worked out perfectly. And then we'll put like some mushrooms in there, and it's going to look like a fallen over log. This is all going to look like very natural. We're going to have some butterflies around here. We're going to have the fountain thing stream that's going to look like that and it's going to look fantastic and this way you can come in and out this is what i decided to do like i said i can decide uh, we put this stuff here um which just allows this is clip added by the way this ethereal glass it's not me but apparently it looks like we can pass through and mobs can't um so that's pretty cool uh, but I'm not sure if I want it like that. I've like sealed everything up so that butterflies can't get out. So we can still have them like flutting around the place and stuff. But I don't know. I don't want something like this because it's just too obstructing. Uh, so we're going to take that. And then what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to figure out something extravagant. And then we're going to prank Clip Addict and get him back for this. Uh, because the Howl Alarm thing is just... Uh, made recording difficult today <laughs> uh, so yeah this is how this is sort of the thing we're going to be going for with this and this isn't going to be here once I'm done with the butterflies going to work out something for the walls I think I'm going to be using the thormium for it which is why I'm like mass producing over there uh, still got a fair bit going through so I love I love these crystal chests because you can actually see if you've still got things in them it's great for automating systems just to make sure everything's stocked up but yeah, that's going to be it for the episode. I just thought I'd show you guys which direction we're going in on this. Uh, getting quite into playing on this again now. I sort of took a little bit of a break from it. Sort of uh, got a little bit tired of it. Because I was playing it like every single day. I just threw my pickaxe on the ground. So I was getting tired of playing it like every single day. Uh, so I took a little bit of a break and I'm back on. I'm keen to get into doing things now really want to get this worked out i don't care if we got a reset coming up in like a week but we are going to get it done so thank you guys very much for watching i hope you guys are enjoying it i can't wait to see what this room looks like when we finish it i will kill clip addict and get rid of that howl alarm um but we will prank him back in the next episode uh you can count on that i'm gonna i'm gonna figure something out i'm gonna figure something grand scale sort of prank in it and we're gonna go big on it go big or go home as they say so anyway guys thank you for watching i still have my shaders mod installed so it's going to be very dark but regardless this is my outro base thing that i do so i hope you guys are having a fantastic day and i hope you guys have liked the episode and i'll see you in the next one bye